We begin, though, with co our coverage tonight with Alan Janae on what went wrong, Alan. Well, Karen, the state had hoped to vaccinate 70 percent of those over 70 by the end of February, but also move that date up with new supplies coming. But now it doesn't seem they are. The Department of Health and Human Services told the Associated Press today that, well, states had been confused, saying that those held in reserve were actually sent out last week, but did call earlier this week for the expansion of vaccine programs. Today, I, I come before you extremely disappointed. Governor Polis shared the news he got from the general who runs Operation Warp Speed. I was informed by General Perna today that there is no Federal Reserve of doses. The Trump administration had said doses were being held in reserve for second shots, but they aren't there. Not just Colorado. Um, all, all the governors, the entire country was 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 lied to. My guess is it's gross incompetence. Uh, I, I, I'm not going to attribute a motive of vengeance. 34,000. 700. It has the state back at the drawing board calculating how vaccines will go out. 35,100 Pfizer vaccinations will continue, but second shots will have to come out of the supply chain, not reserves. The governor's anger was followed by President elect Biden's candor. We remain in a very dark winter. Biden announced he'll put the National Guard and FEMA to work and still tried to deliver 100 million vaccinations in his first 100 days. He says he'll invoke the Wartime Defense Production Act to boost production of the vaccine, syringes, and protective equipment. It'll mean additional mass vaccination sites. Our plan is as clear as it is bold. Get more people vaccinated for free. Create more places for them to get vaccinated. But he says the pandemic is nowhere near over. The honest truth is this. Things will get worse before they get better. I told you I'll always level with you. Three questions still remain. When, when, and when? When will Colorado finish vaccinating 70% of its people over 70? Well, the governor says hopefully still by the end of February. When will Colorado start vaccinating those 65 and over and some frontline workers? The governor says hopefully a couple of weeks before that, puts it at mid-February. And when would the National Guard potentially start these large vaccination sites? They had nothing to say when I contacted them today. In Denver, I'm Alan Janae, covering Colorado First.